Combat. Now, I won't pretend to be a massive fan of the series, but I did pick up Ace Combat 6 back in 07 or so, and even in a year that was awash with AAA masterpieces, it was one of the standout games I played that year. It isn't perfect, and it's so Japanese that even the control scheme is slanted. It's just a joke, calm the fuck down. But it's a nice little arcade-style flight game that seems to dwell perpetually on the fault line between flight sims and arcade shoot-em-ups. And I'll say this just once. Uncharted, Mass Effect, Rage, Crisis, they're all gorgeous games, but the best graphics I've seen this generation have been in Ace Combat games. But hey, that's just my gaping, swollen, inflamed opinion. <clears throat> and may I say the newest title sounds like it was generated by Square Enix. For my money, Assault Horizon and its equally nonsensical tagline of Make Metal Bleed is right down there with Crisis Core and Agito 13 somewhere in the seventh concentric circle of marketing hell. Square must have an entire head trauma ward devoted to the singular task of spinning these golden titles for them. And so long as asymmetrical fashionistas at BukakiCon 2012 shove their life savings at anything with a Final Fantasy logo plastered on the front, you'll be guaranteed to see meaningful video game and film titles like Advent Children and Air Guys. I mean, what in the name of the goddamn Savage Orient is a motherfucking Air Guys, people? That isn't even almost a word. That's the kind of shit that happens when your cat sits on the keyboard. Fuck the very fabric of this reality for generating that fucking game. And I'll tell you what's even more irritating than Square Enix making up bullshit words. Ace Combat Assault Horizon's very existence. Now, to understand how, like, hymen-smashingly painful this game is, you first have to understand how basic flight controls work in Ace Combat. Let, let's start with something that's almost as juvenile as the game's title. A simple turn. Okay, there's no turn button. If you're flying a plane in real life in a game, it doesn't matter. There's no turn function. If you want to make a minor course correction, you pull on the rudder, right? You'll list to the left or list to the right. But if you're in the throes of a mid-air dogfight and Slippy needs your motherfucking help, what you have to do is turn your plane on its side and then pull the stick back to make a sharp turn. That's what's called a bank one of the most basic moves in modern aviation, but Ace Combat Assault Horizon, it's such a Jersey Shore caliber lobotomy, the game doesn't even trust you to bring your plane back to its upright and locked position after turning, as if you'll let it drift and eventually fly into the motherfucking sun or some shit. So the game automatically corrects and puts you perfectly parallel with the ground below. So if you're just turning out of some mid-air somersault or something, the game will flip the fuck out and say you're trying to turn to the right of the somersault. Well, not if the game doesn't want you to. It'll yank you off in the, the opposite direction to level your plane out. All the while, an enemy's climbed all the way inside your large intestine while you struggle valiantly against the only true enemy you'll ever face during the course of Ace Combat Assault Horizon. And that enemy's name is Namco. I mean, first Namco gave Soul Calibur a good raw fucking by streamlining the ever-loving dick out of it until Soul Calibur mutated into a fucking Star Wars fighting game, and not even a good one like Masters of Terras Cassie. Oh, and now Ezio is in Soul Calibur. Happy fucking day. Then they bent Tekken over the sofa and perma-fucked that franchise, and now Ace Combat is Call of Duty with wings. Bite the fattest part of my beautiful cock, Namco. I'm Razorfist. And I need to go lie down. God, fucking speed!